Governor Mohamed Abubakar, who arrived at the State House at about 3 o'clock Wednesday afternoon, went straight to the President's office for the briefing held behind closed doors. Briefing newsmen shortly after the meeting, which lasted about one hour, the Bauchi State Governor described all the allegations leveled against him on the misuse of public funds as baseless, unfounded, and mischievous. Among the allegations uh, is the fact that uh, we misapplied the bailout funds. And I thought that was a matter of common knowledge in Nigeria. I, 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 ICPC investigated uh, uh, the bailout and they, they gave a report in which they initially said Bauchi State utilized all but 165 million. And I wrote to them, I said, no, check your facts again. So all in all, Bauchi State has utilized 8.6 billion except 18 million naira. And this 18 million naira is in, an, uh, in a dedicated account. The governor who attributed the attacks on his person by the lawmakers to politics promised not to be deterred in his commitment to not only making Bauchi work, but ensure that it remains the stronghold of the governing All Progressives Congress. The fact to ascertain is politics of Bauchi state is played in Bauchi, not in Abuja. All right? The grassroots of the party and the people are intact with the governor and the APC. So I have not closed the door for reconciliation. Uh, some elders in Bauchi, as we speak, uh, are still trying uh, to reconcile the, the, the war factions. And what was the president's response to the governor's briefing? The response of the uh, president is that I should close my ears and continue the good work that I am doing for the good people of Bauchi State. From the State House, Adamu Sambu, NTA News.